Okay guys, so I actually just did something pretty awesome. I am changing the manifold on my RAM because it is making a ticking noise. Reason being is because this guy was broken, right? So that tip stuck in there and I actually just removed it with just a drill bit, which is pretty freaking sick because um, I didn't have to buy an extractor kit or anything like that. So pretty much what I did is um, I put it on a low speed and I just drilled a hole right through the actual bolt, right? Okay, and then after I got in deep enough, I put it in reverse and check this out. Oops. It's a little hard to do this with um one hand. Look at that. So if you get enough bite on it, you can actually it out with the drill bit just kind of angle it the way I'm doing and it will come out look at that pretty sick huh no extractors nothing crazy just a drill bit And that is on reverse. Like I said first, I drilled the hole. Oh, and it came out. Okay guys, so I pretty much was able to take it out with nothing but a 964th drill bit from Milwaukee. This is their Red Helix series. They are designed for hard metals um, and all kinds of stuff, right? So pretty much, like I said, I drilled into the actual bolt about half an inch to maybe three quarters of an inch, right? Made sure I took my time uh, at a slow speed. Once I got deep enough, all I did was knock it into reverse and slowly but surely it started to pull the bolt out. Um, I did have to give the drill a bit of an angle so that it would bite the actual bolt and it came out. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, these Rams, these fourth generation Rams are pretty much notoriously known for these manifolds. Um, the gasket starts to leak because the bolts break. I believe it's because they are a different metal than the manifold. I'm not sure, I'm not a mechanic. But the point is I got it out, uh, like I said, with nothing but a drill bit. So it's pretty cool. Good luck out there, guys. I hope you guys get as lucky as me. Um, obviously if you guys are as beast as me, so good luck guys. See you next time.